Hi guys, it is currently Monday, so it is the day after Sunday, obviously, and I'm going to switch it up a bit. So, I'm going to do like a semi-unedited vlog. This was not planned at all, so the only thing I'm going to do in regards to this is to just add music to the sped up parts so they don't get all boring. Other than that, I ain't going to do jack shit. Want to know why? Because I feel like it. Want to know why? Because I'm a boss ass bitch. Want to know why? Because it's my YouTube channel. So, switching it up. My unedited week of my life are going to be a lot different without my camera. The piping hot tea uh, is coming out on Wednesday, which you guys have already seen by now. Love ya. Hi guys, it is currently Monday night. Oh, that is my phone. I'm such a dummy. Alexa, what time is it? So it's currently 8.14 p.m. as you may or may not have heard and today has been a hard day. Obviously you guys heard from the last video um, I was in a car accident. Um, it was, well, you guys can go see the video. I'll have it up in the eye for you guys, but you can go kind of get some insight on what happened there. But um, basically we, we meaning me and my mom dropped off my car at the, um, pretty much like a, a collision center um driving there was easy and then my mom was going to we had gotten a rental car for me and then which it was supposed to be on site but it wasn't on site So we had to get a rental car, um, which I'll show you guys what she looks like. She's pretty basic rental car. I mean, because of my age, I couldn't get much. So, um, because if you guys don't know, I'm 21. My birthday is August 26, 2002. So we're almost there. But that's lightning in the background. But, and then when I was heading home, or like I had gotten the rental car and then I pretty much, it was, you know me, I have a truck. I, I'm up higher, so having like a, Nissan Sandra or something was not for me. Um, but I'm living with it. And my mom followed me home and then she went to work. Other than that, right before we left, I did my exercises. So, or my workout, I should say. But that is when I came home. I showered and I put on Scooby-Doo on my phone while I showered just to have something in the background not so quiet and eerie like I always do and then I talked to my aunt while I was making breakfast and then I think I watched some YouTube and then I went to work 
going to work was easy. And then coming home wasn't. But I kind of expected it not to be easy because of the fact that it happened right near my work. So I could understand, even though I don't go that route, I could understand why. But, and for those of you who are new here, because I do still have a lot of new subscribers here, that was my first ever accident. Whether, like I said, you guys could go watch it the um kind of where i give you an update on why i was kind of mia the entire week um but like i said there it's semi for me like a minor accident for me but believe you it wasn't so minor so i'm just navigating through my feelings and how hard it is and how much anxiety it gives you. So I kind of realized that not only do I have OCD, I have anxiety. But I'm channeling my way through it and what's nice is the fact that I listen to a lot of music. So I know that music can help me calm down, which is nice. So, yes, but on other news, I kind of just wanted to say, hey, welcome to the vlog. This is going to be a very chill week, considering I'm just taking it day by day. And yeah, so for dinner, since me and my mom totally forgot to pick out something from the freezer me and her just had a whatever day I had the rest of my breakfast because it's so easy I could just heat it up in the microwave and it's healthy so other than that I had um, my mom had I think she I think she had some wings but yeah, I'm currently just watching, I'll have it up in the eye for you guys as well, but I'm watching Alyssa Rose's bridal shower video. And I'm kind of just relaxing because today has been a lot emotionally. So I will see you guys in the morning and hopefully with me being in my actual routine and not like not like a different routine hopefully I can feel a lot less anxiety fulfilled I guess but I just wanted to say hey and I'll see you guys tomorrow
Damn it. Bon appetit. Sorry for the shakiness. That's a fucking blue jay. Oh my god, there's so many fucking lizards. I panicked. I'm panicking. Okay. So, I never showed you guys that I was going to Wal- oh. Going to Walmart and all these. I'm so overheated. Because it's like 100 million degrees outside. And I have a public sub with me. It's a buffalo chicken tender sub with white cheese, white American cheese on it. I'm snacking on. I am so sorry guys. Now I start to get hungry and quite literally tired. 
So me and my mom got bagged salmon from Aldi's and it was a mushy. So we're gonna redo with fresh salmon. Maybe we got used to the fresh salmon. Um, so we have wild caught Alaskan sockeye salmon or as people say, salmon. <clears throat> There's no order to this at all. I got pineapple spears from Aldi's and this was new, but I've been dying to try the Ber Barrera, I think that's how you say it, tacos. And you can't tell me this seasoned bad boy does not look good already. So we're going to put it in the crock pot on Saturday pardon me and we're gonna have burrera tacos i think this is this is beef so that's what we're gonna have sour cream because on sunday last week me and my mom got steaks from aldi's going the opposite direction and um we never ate them this week. She doesn't want to do them today. She wants steak and loaded potatoes. I guess she got a recipe from one of her coworkers and it apparently sounds good. I got two of the cookie dough uh, flips and two of the s'mores flips. One more of each. Oh, I guess I got three s'mores. My bad. Two of my Fairlife milks. And if anyone's wondering, I do the 2% on both the regular milk and the chocolate milk. And I had down on Sunday or on one of our weekdays doing like an orange chicken, like an air fried version, but I couldn't find anything and I didn't find a good recipe. So I changed it up. We're doing an Asian stir fry instead. It comes with the sauce, the veggies. Huh. Hopefully there's meat in there. Hmm. Okay. I guess I'll be adding chicken to this. <laughs> I guess I'll be adding chicken to this. I didn't realize that it didn't have any meat in it. So we're gonna have a chicken Asian stir fry. Uh, I have extra lean ground beef for tacos that I'm going to make. I made a video on how I made um, potato and like kind of like a taco bowl. I freaking hated it. I'm going to be honest. I thought I liked it the more I started eating it. I hated it. So we have biscuits. I'll have the link down below for you guys, but um, it's from Pinterest, but it's kind of like a, I think it's called a bubble pizza and you cut these up in to fourths. You put it in a pan, you put the sauce, the pizza sauce, and then you put the cheese and pepperoni. That's what I'm gonna make with this during the week. And then I have Mexican cheese for the Brero tacos and for my tacos. I think that's it. I have two of my dad's milks. Okay. I'm doing all the cold stuff first and then I'm gonna pause and I'll come back with you guys. I have my chocolate milk here. Again, the 2% one. I freaking love Fairlife. 
And for those of you who are lactose free um, or just want to find a healthier version, um, this is not dairy free milk. Let me tell you, this is not dairy free milk. It says lactose free. That does not mean it's lactose intolerant free. I didn't know that, so I wanted to pass on the information. But this, like regular milk, like that milk, upsets. It doesn't upset my stomach more. It just, like, it just doesn't sit right. And it's the worst when you're going number two, two. Uh, my dad's creamer, my mom's creamer, and this is from Walmart. My mom's creamer. And then you guys know that I have been making fucking eggs like crazy. So we like the maple bacon. So two packages of maple bacon that are going in the freezer. I'm going to do a quick time lapse after I chew on one bite. And then I'll come back to you guys with the rest of the haul. Bread, I have to find room in the freezer because there's bread on the list and we didn't need fucking bread on the list. My keto-friendly bread that goes in my room. Taco shells, uh, mainly just in case our other ones aren't good anymore. Pepperoni for our bubble pizza thingy. And then random taco seasoning for my lunches next week. Two Gatorades for my dad because he only likes the or uh, orange Gatorade even though he drinks every other Gatorade. Of course you can't go without making a dessert in this household. Mainly because I deserve this damn dessert for all the shit that I have gone through. So we're going to cook her eventually today. Blueberries. I totally forgot I got fucking blueberries to make blueberry muffins. And the off-brand version of Lowry seasoning salt. Hostess cupcakes that I have to hide in my room because my dad will eat them all, even though my mom is the one who wanted them. Uh, a spray bottle for our in-home garden because honestly, we're doing, me and my mom are like jalapenos, green onions, cilantro, basil, another cilantro plant, another basil plant. I have lavender in my room. We have spider plants. We have another plant or two in here. Um, I think just a lot of shit in this house. So a lot of greenery. So my mom's fish oil. My cheese carbonara because I can't live without her. And um, I had to get my mom wiper blades for her car. So I had to get two different wiper blades. My Dr. Pepper her wine and a case of water because I've been drinking actual water bottles. Hydrate yourself, bitches. I'm gonna hydrate myself and I am just going to scrummage through all of this and put it in its place. I didn't realize that I was doing time lapse, but here's the bag of potatoes that I forgot about too. Hi guys, I am back. Today is Sunday. 
date last time you guys saw me was Thursday and Thursday after I got home and ended the spend the morning with me I quite literally just relaxed the entire afternoon and did absolute garbage and nothing Friday I woke up I did my five minute workout showered ate breakfast and made my lunch and went to work Saturday me and my madre got our nails done I made a video on that which the vlog and all the transition videos are um, already up. I will have a good picture for you guys on the screen. But yeah, and then other than that, me and my mom came back home, picked up my dad because he was working. So we picked up my dad and then we went and dropped him off at the bingo place. And my mom had made a sandwich, but I wanted an acai bowl from the Planet Fitness, which is also like a cold stone. And then we played bingo. We came home, ate the Biro Tacos, which I got the actual seasoned meat from Aldi's. If I can find a picture of it, I'll have it up here. Um, so yeah. Other than that, we did absolute garbage again. Last night, I worked on the uh four videos that i made like nail transition slash nail vlogs um i worked on today's video was already up and i made homemade the thumbnail i had to uh do a quick photo shoot for that other than that this morning i got up and then i relaxed my mom was doing her like finishing her nails she got like nail gems so she put a glitter coat on and then put the gems on and then she put another coat like a clear coat on and then she helped me make my omelet for breakfast and then we got ready and kind of cleaned the house a bit and then we had to stop at the farmer's market because we wanted to see if they have eggs they didn't the the guy wasn't even there so we did pretty much like a big loop around. We went from that city to the city in which we um, went to the Asian meat market. This is what I got. You guys know that I get the regular ones and I do have the regular ones. I'll have a picture of the packaging for you guys if you guys ever want to try to find them. These are good. These are good for like honestly like pretty much carving your chocolate craving when you're not like really wanting chocolate chocolate but it's like just enough chocolate that's what this is good for it's good but it's not going to be like i can eat four of them in one sitting type of go not that i would want to and then y'all also know or if you're not if you don't know and thumbnails um if you're new here i love the cheese carbonara this is the cream carbonara which is the creamy version of the cheese carbonara this is good i actually found this at the asian store and i tried one pack of it and then i haven't gotten it since but this would be good you know this would be a good try or a good keep in the house because i do like this and the cheese carbonara the i'll have the one that i do like here the only thing is i have to add like shredded cheese because i kind of got used to that cheesy factor in these bulldog noodles my mom really did not go there for much she just wanted a couple different types of mushrooms she got white beach mushrooms she always gets one of these every time even though I can get these like literally anywhere for her. They're pretty much like um, the koalas or whatever. I'll have a picture. Oh, the Hello Pandas, pretty much the same thing. She got, she said that I should get this one too. So she said that she would buy this one. So there's that. She got um, oyster mushrooms. Like I said, she got a lot. She got 
bean sprouts. I love me some bean sprouts. Gnocchi mushrooms. These are okay. I like the thinner ones though. Snow white mushrooms. I think this is what I originally got. So, And then we got... Saki, and then I think we got another type of Saki too. So we got two Sakis, and then she's a picky bitch, and she and I both use chopsticks. Um, she mainly mainly uses her chopsticks at like work, but she wanted longer chopsticks because where she holds them, she needs them to be longer. I'm not picky at all. I don't really care. So. I told her to get the, the the ones that I really wanted, which are these ones. So it was this one and then like a blacker version. But other than that, we also stopped at Target because we had to get eggs because we're almost out of eggs and obviously we couldn't get the farm fresh eggs. But obviously we see the Ninja Creamy shit. I don't have a Ninja Creamy, so I'm gonna make a short um, making a Ninja Creamy without a ninja creamy so look out for that this is the ghost if you guys have any good protein powder recommendations i am one for not liking the kind of like weird flavor the i guess the chalky flavor i don't like that i don't think anyone would but chips ahoy sounded very nice and i'm making it obviously for ice cream so that's like perfect so we went with the ghost whey protein and i've never had whey protein so before i even obviously if you guys watched the sunday video you guys know the whole alani new situation it made me have the mix shits um so that's pretty much if you guys did not watch it it literally you guys should still go watch it it's up here but you guys should still go watch it but it had me having the mix shits literally at work so we have the ghost it's the chips ahoy one uh i just want to kind of try a bunch of different ones so oh shit uh i found a loofah while i was walking to the beauty section so i need a new loofah uh jello for the thingy i got the vanilla one kind of in my hand or my head goes together i didn't the target that i went to isn't like a super target so they didn't have many options um i went for my coco kind they didn't have any and they didn't have any of the true skin ones either so i had to go with a large purchase i didn't know that this was going to be fucking huge caroline price i spent 25 fucking dollars on this so it best be good I best not want be wanting to go back to the Coco Kind after spending that fucking price. And then more Fair Life for the Ninja Creamy. Because I started drinking Fair Life because it's like, I guess it's ultra filtered, so it's a little different than like a regular 2% gallon of milk like from Borden um it's a little different and it makes me not go make shits so um and my mom found out that she has Sjogren's so we are trying to both kind of just be healthier um I found out that I only liked those farm fresh eggs that's part of the reason why that I hated eggs for so long in my life they had to be with something. Um, so we're trying the Eglin's Best. Maybe it'll be kind of like similar considering it's organic. Maybe it'll be, um, you know, it'll hopefully be better. So that's all the shit that we got so we have a big to-do list today so my parents are gone I don't know how long they're going to be gone so I'm going to utilize this time very wisely to get as much as of the shit that I want done done it's hard to make ASMR shit with them around because they talk a lot and they watch their own tv and yada yada so my goal is to put you guys on the counter and 
pretty much put all of this shit away uh, where it goes. And then I'm going to make, quickly make the, um, find a recipe, like a quick recipe, kind of just so I could guide myself and make this ASMR video real quick. And then I have, I just switched laundry, so that'll be out of the way. I want to make Wednesday's video, which is like a piping hot tea. By this time, you guys have already seen it by now. Also, we'll have it up in the eye for you guys. Kind of just giving you a lot of life updates, the piping hot tea, what's been happening, you know, more updates on the car and everything like that. And then I also, um, if I can get at least the baking ASMR portion of the blueberry, like the, the prepping, not the prepping, but like the prepping before you put it in the oven because I'm making blueberry muffins. That would work too. Um, I'm gonna make tacos with this extra um, lean ground beef. So maybe I'll put it into like a dinner ASMR maybe like, uh, instead of like a meal prepping video. Uh, we'll see um, as well. Um, what's for dinner time? steaks maybe i'll do that i don't know i don't know we have a lot of things um i kind of just want to also get my meal prepping done as well to get that out of the way and if i have time i kind of want to get my workout completed out here so let's just get started <laughs> So while I'm getting shit in order, I'm going to update you guys. So first off, I filmed the, um, I filmed the ASMR video. I don't even know what I filmed. What did I film? I filmed a short that I needed to film and then I went and filmed the piping hot tea video and then I started filming the blueberry video like the ASMR blueberry muffins video and now I just switch burners. Sometimes that one wants to be working and others it doesn't. Now, I have four containers uh, here that I am kind of getting ready at the moment. I am starting to meal prep my lunch. Usually I do five days, but these are tacos, so I'm gonna do four days worth of tacos. Um, just because sometimes Wednesday, I mean Thursday when I have off, sometimes I don't always want my meal prep. So I'm gonna do four days and see how it goes. I'm just doing regular schmegular tacos. Nothing crazy. I have this taco mix here. Um, And this, this meat is 96% lean and 4% fat. I want to get ones that are more lean than fat, obviously. These are both from Aldi's. So yeah, once my pan heats up, I will come back to you guys. I actually kind of want to switch laundry, so I'm going to start the meat in here. take a little bit of time anyway because it's still kind of partially frozen.
Okay. I'll be back. Okay, there was a little delay, uh, which it doesn't matter because I would like it to cool off anyway. But now I'm gonna add a bit of water. lighting it's my phone but clearly you guys saw that I just finished the laundry and I put away all three loads the whites the darks and mine um I also did uh get rid of the dishwasher the clean stuff in the dishwasher cleaned all the dishes here put some in there and then the ones that I could wash there. I also tidied up here. My mom still wants to cut carrots, so I'll leave that for her. But I think I have a Dr. Pepper. I have a fucking Dr. Pepper here. I put this in well over two hours ago since my parents left, maybe even three hours ago. I turned on the oven um, for the Mashed, loaded mashed potatoes 
I think my parents are coming home from the, um, I also did my workout and showered. I did my everything shower, but for now, I'm going to just currently work on Monday's video that I need to get up tonight, which it's only 24 minutes, so it's really not that long, but that's what I'm going to work on until something else goes on but I will see you guys later.